I think it's a very important conference because it will wrap up all the knowledge that we have about climate, uh, the advances brought about by IPCC process, just a few months before the very critical, very important uh, conference of the parties of the, world, of the climate conference. Uh, and uh, we really have to make a big step forward in Paris in December. And I think this conference is preparing the stage to make that big jump, which is really to have serious commitments by all nations of the planet for mitigation, also serious commitments for adaptation. Uh, we can't see uh, a future in which fossil fuel will become less and less important and we are going to have a world uh, uh, fueled by the sun, by solar energy, by the winds, by the, the oceans. So we can see that before 2030, 2040, we might have more than 50% of the energy uh, provided by these renewable sources, clean sources. Uh, be beyond 2050, we, we could have most of the energy. Towards the end of the century, we are going to have all of the energy provided by clean sources. So for the tropics, more and more we are learning how to develop the tropics without the deforestation. Uh, deforestation has been declining all over the tropics, in particular in South America, tremendously. In Brazil, deforestation has been brought down 83% in the last nine years. So we are proposing in Brazil a new development for the tropics, a development based on biodiversity, the value of biodiversity for the economy and not on cutting down the forest and re replacing the forest. So I think there are many good suggestions for the global tropics and we could bring deforestation or tropical deforestation close to zero before 2030. Now science and technology start really showing the way forward, solutions. So this conference is really is full with solutions offered to governments, offered to policy. So we are not only saying something bad will happen in the future. We are saying there are solutions, there are technological solutions within the reach of our arms that can really put the planet in a different and sustainable trajectory.